Hey guys, so it's Ryan, and I have two things today. Number one, I'm officially registered as an iPhone developer, and uh, I have a game called Can Smash awaiting to get in. It should be about two weeks, and I'm not releasing any details, and I'll let you guys know when it's up. And another thing, I learned so much more Objective-C, I don't know how, I just, one day I just got really into it, I watched a whole lot of tutorials, did a lot of practice, and now I know it really good. So, so this is a tutorial today on how to click a button, and when it's clicked, it'll hide another thing. But we're going to be doing hiding a button. And you can hide as many things you want all at once, and I will show you that in the tutorial. So create a view-based application called hide. Drop down your classes and your resources. Okay, so go into your viewcontroller.h, and we're going to make an IP outlet for a UI button, call that button. And another IP outlet for a UI image view star, call that image. We're going to be hiding two things at once. And then create an IB action for hide, colon ID sender. Okay. Copy that last line. Go to view controller dot M. Do this a little bigger and paste it in. So then we're gonna type in button dot hidden equals yes semicolon and then image dot hidden equals yes. Make sure they're all in capitals. Okay. Now you can go into your XIB. I should like to put a background. Okay. And you know what I do with the sexy navigation bar? Hide. Okay. So we're gonna put a one button in top or the bottom let's yeah. Hide all. So go to your files owner and your connections and put the hide touch up inside. And then we're gonna want to add an image view. At the top. Because we hid an image too. And we're also gonna hide a button. Okay. So files owner connections, button to the button, the image to the image. And I don't have any media in here, so we'll just import any picture, it doesn't matter. I'll just put in, um, here we go, let's take a picture of this flower. Put in your resources. Okay, it's kind of big. Uh, oh yeah, sure, it has to be a PNG. Sorry about that, guys. I'll take this box. And PNG. And we can drag that into our resources. And then go back to your view controller in the media and drag the box into the image view. Okay. So now everything is set up. And now we can make sure it's on the iPhone simulator. And now we can build and run. So when you click the button, it will hide everything that's on the screen that we declared right here. So the button is going to be hidden. So I click this, everything's hidden. And if you want to unhide it, you can create another IB action for unhide. It's kind of like the same exact method that we used, except right here. this we can copy this and then we're gonna switch this to no no okay go back to your view controller just drag that to that and there we go so let's straighten them out now let's build and run one more time. Hide all, unhide all. That doesn't do anything. So hide and unhide. Um, this is really useful in a lot of different apps that you use. If you want to like click a button, and then or when something pops up, then you no, know, it's really useful. So that's all. Thank you for watching.